Karen here with We Go Fishing, and today we are going to teach you how to install bearing buddies. You are going to need these if you have a boat with a trailer. It only takes one season in salt water or two seasons in fresh water for your bearings to go bad. And you don't want to. All right, we're going to start. You're going to need some tools. First, a cup of coffee. Everyone needs that. Second, you're going to need some sort of hammer. You can use a rubber mallet, or I can't find mine right now, so I'm going to use a hammer and a block of wood. We're going to use this screwdriver to help wedge the cap off, and then you're going to need a grease gun. And if you have pretty hands, you want to protect them with some gloves when you get the grease. All right, so let's get started. All right, guys, so step one is to loosen this cap. All right guys, so it might be a little hard to get this off, but just keep working at it. I wanted to tell you where you can get your bearing buddies. These cost $30 for the pair. You can pick them up at Amazon and also there's other places that would sell that also. Also your um, grease gun you can pick up at any hardware store or also on Amazon. All right, now we can see there was some grease in there, but not a whole lot. So, we want to get our new bearing buddy. Now make sure that the blue part is facing out because that's going to pop out when we put the grease in about an eighth of an inch and that's how we're going to know there's enough grease in there. So if that's not popping out, you know you need to put your um, grease gun in and fill it up again. So that's what's nice about this is you're just going to be able to pop this cap. Just It's just rubber. Pull this cap right off and you can check before you go on a trip and make sure that this blue part is out just a little bit because there's a spring in there and you need to know that there's enough grease in your bearings so it doesn't ever lock up on you. So we're just gonna put it in and wanna get our wood so we don't damage it as we hammer this in. Check and make sure it's in there on all sides. All right, just making sure that we're in there and even on all sides. And it looks like it, so you want to make sure there's no gaps and it's completely in there. Make sure it's not sticking out at the bottom or the top. You don't want that to come out. Now. The next step is not putting the cap on. The next step is your grease. Don't just put the cap on, that would be a mistake. All right, so you can see right here inside, there's a, um, this tool will connect to your bearing buddy. So you just have to push it right on. It's very simple and start pumping. And again, we're watching for that spring to push that blue cap out about an eighth of an inch. All right, guys, so we just finished our grease and it's nice and loose and it's about an eighth of an inch out. So we have enough grease in there. Make sure you use marine grade grease. All right, not just any grease, definitely not. Um, so the last step, we can take off our gloves now, is simply putting on our cute little bearing buddy cap. All right, and that's what's nice about this. It's so easy to pop right off and check and make sure, okay, yeah, I got some grease in there. You're ready to go. All right, now just do the other side. 